my name is Raj and I'm going to show you uh, some cleaning uh, procedures on the Gadget Brera. Uh, Gadget Brera is an automatic paint cup machine and uh, some of the uh, things that you do on an, on an automatic machine, something similar to uh, the Anima range or the Naviglio range, they are very similar internally. So this might apply to others as well. Uh, but I'm going to show you the Brera and Brera has uh, um, a, a valve inside which actually controls the water flow from the, the boiler to the brewing unit and also uh, to the steam pipe and this has got a control valve which can be controlled so if you turn it to the right you send water to the steam pipe uh, or if you have it in the middle it comes through and press the button it will come through the normal uh, dispenser here now a frequently asked question is uh, when when it gets blocked especially if you haven't descaled it on a regular basis and also just make sure that you run water through on a regular basis both through the steam pipe and through the through the head it's quite important to do that uh, but descaling is very important on a regular basis if you don't do that it can block some of the parts inside. The main part that it blocks is a, a valve that looks like this. Uh, and this can actually, if you look at it this way, this is the control knob that turns. That's connected to here. The water uh, I'll try and show you, if I can, based on a, a sh closer shot. So if I actually show this one here, uh, this comes through here. If you had the water opened to the right, the control knob, water will go through that particular valve and come through the steam pipe. If you had it in the middle and pressed a button, it will come through and come through this part which is actually the uh, valve that enters the brewing unit. So this goes into a little part like that, that goes in there, and you'll actually see this part if I remove the, uh, the door here. So you can see here there is a brewing unit that comes out, and here there is that little uh, outlet valve and that's that valve there and that valve goes in there so the water has to push through this particular section this is quite a delicate part which has got a spring and a valve that means that it needs a lot of pressure for it to go through so make sure that that part is cleaned by doing a descale on a regular basis if you find that water is coming through here especially when you are doing a test mode uh, and you find that uh, through the test mode now you can actually see how you do the test mode on the um, on the gadgetdirect.com web website there is a video uh, link to um, useful videos or cleaning videos or test mode videos test mode videos will give you uh, a, a, an explanation of how to do the test mode now you can actually send water through the steam pipe or through the head when the brewing unit is in its work position so make sure that um, that is done and if you are finding that the water is not coming through the front of the machine do a descale manually using the test mode and try and send water through uh, the, the brewing unit the brewing unit also can be blocked so that needs a good clean as well make sure that you this particular part so on the on this side you can see a little socket there when you actually push the brewing unit in this socket engages with a little tube on the top right top left hand corner of the wall that takes the coffee to the dispenser so basically you have got a brewing unit 
if you if I showed you that latch is undone now so that's the work it's going to go to the work position by actually coming out of there the coffee is there presses in water comes through from the outlet valve in here goes up and infuses the coffee goes through the socket into the tube and through there so all those places which comes into contact with coffee can be soiled with coffee oils and that can also cause blockages so subscribe to our YouTube channel and uh, like us on Facebook.